You're paying me, right? Yeah. With love. Lots um, of love. Not lots. <laughs> Welcome to Brew Reviews. My name's Lee and I'm drinking Ballast Point Dead Ringer Oktoberfest. I'm a big fan of Ballast Point. Uh, their Grapefruit Sculpin is my favorite beer. I discovered it. Wait, uh, Sculpin? Sculpin. I always thought it was Scallion. Sculpin. It has a P in it. It's a type of fish. Scallion's the like onion you well, call I know it. Scallion's an onion. I use this thing. What's on the bottle again? It's like a, a it's dead a, skeleton. It's a skeleton. A dead like, skeleton. That's a stupid thing to say. It's a skeleton with a beer and a pretzel and later hosen. Really? Yes, that's exactly what it is. If I'm a skeleton, I want some pretzels. I want some later hosen if I'm a skeleton. <laughs> Cover up all those bits. I taste absolutely nothing there, actually. Oktoberfest is always a strange one to me. I either really like them or I don't. This one I think I'll like because it's lighter but still has a darker color. Last time I was here, we had like an, an explosion. It was an incident. Look All right. at that. You, there, you there had no... I had an argument about whether it would fit and it fit like a charm. The color is actually like extremely dark. Like it's a very dark caramely brown. It doesn't really have any spices or anything in it, so it's not getting much of an aroma. It smells like it's an a, ale. It's um, a pure October. Yeah, it just smells like a good it's one. Bare bones, yeah. one could say. <laughs> Yeah, I'm getting definitely a little bit of caramel note to it. It's very smooth. It's got that extra hot um, carbonization that makes it kind of like go down smoother and a little bit thicker, creamier. Like the nitro spears, if you ever have one of those, it's like kind of a creamy taste to it. That's what we got going on. Now I have to pound this, right? Yeah, I mean. What? If, if you want to impress Nixad. <laughs> You have been preparing. <sighs> Let me see those Boy Scout patches. I have the burp brewing. I promised myself I wouldn't burp on camera, so I'm like trying to hold it back right now. That was a nice one to pound. It wasn't he heavy and thick, uh, so I could drink it pretty quickly and easily. Even though everyone I've had, they're not super heavy. Like it's not stout or anything like that. I always expect Oktoberfest to be heavy. It almost never is. Around here, at least most people, when they think Oktoberfest, they think Sam Adams. I'd probably put that a little bit above Sam Adams in terms of how Ooh. I like it. A little bit mellower tones and it just goes down nicely. I would say on a scale of day old leftover pizza um, to a five star French cuisine diner, um, it would probably be like a $30 steak at like a Texas longhouse. I'm just hungry, I actually am. Do we have snacks? I can find snacks. Okay. If you want to watch more brew reviews, click the jugs or the card above my head. Bing! If you want to subscribe because you really love us, click the face. All about that face. All about that face. Uh, I don't know all about yeah. that face. Bye! Have a good night! See you later. Good night. Alligator. After a while, alligator. No? Crocodile. That's it. After a while, crocodile. That was a little forced. I know, I actually couldn't remember what? it.